from there and um, you know, you have know. that kind of Comfort zone. Yeah, no, I think those guys work really hard in the offseason. That whole group, they've improved, you know, and just really trying to use last year as the foundation and just build from there. So, like I said, it's been good. First two days, they've been working hard, just continuing to detail everything with the installs. Um, but I've been happy with the first two days. You've got two guys that have both started and, and been very productive as starters. How, how do you balance that as you go forward to, you know, trying to, to ensure that they're both part of things? I think really it's just creating competition in the room. That's mm -hmm. the most important thing. We can continue to create competition in the room. I think those guys within that room know that they all have roles of helping this football team win um, and get better. But again, the more we can compete against each other, make each other better, that's only going to allow the cream uh, to rise to the top. And so, like I said, it's been fun just to watch those guys compete the uh, first two days. How much of a help is it to have uh, a guy like AP or even Jamar, who's had the experience now um, with these guys coming up like Madison and yeah, no, I think uh, obviously when you can have some experience in that room, in any room, uh, that helps because those younger guys can ask those older guys questions and rely on them a little bit and more or less, even if they're not asking questions, just see about how they go about their day-to-day -day business of being a student athlete. You know, how, how do they prepare for meetings? How are they preparing their bodies? Um, asking those guys questions that they may not always feel comfortable to ask the coach, you know, and so having those veterans in the room has been awesome and they're growing into re being really good leaders. Did AP and Jamar complement each other at all, you know, with the, the styles of play they bring? I think so. You know, I think uh, AP obviously has got that next gear, which we all saw some last year, you know, and then Munch can run as well. Um, but then at the same time, Munch's a little bit thicker than, than uh, AP, so he can get downhill and be physical, but at the same time, AP's a physical guy too. And so, like I said, as we're putting this whole thing together, it's finding how all of our offensive pieces complement each other so we can just become the better offense. When you have two guys like that, does it help to maybe know that you always have a fresh running back you can put out there? Yeah, you know, that's kind of our philosophy is we want to, again, have packages for different guys to do things, and so that enables us to keep guys fresh throughout the season and so there isn't one guy that's having to carry the load um, and then they're being you know their bodies take a little bit of that toll and so that is nice having again some depth in that room.